Hey, good morning. Welcome to another episode of The Daily Dose. So I'm gonna teach you today how not to get stuck in the weeds. Now, it might not be like seaweed, but what happens on the weekends? Time and time again, you get stuck. You get stuck, whereas I see like some of the garbage, you know, the garbage that comes washed up in the shore gets stuck in the seaweed. It might not be seaweed that you're getting stuck in, but definitely in some weeds, right? That's what happens. The weekends become our weakest link. So I'm gonna share with you just a moment um, how to get unstuck, how to keep yourself from staying out of the weeds. And I'm talking about it, it can be related to anything. So here's the deal. Here's the deal. Simplify, simplify, simplify. The weekends people get stuck because they overcomplicate things. They make things so not simple. Simplify your weekends. And how do you do that? You have a plan. What do you want to achieve? Listen, if you're on a weight loss plan, if you're trying to get your lives back in order, get back on a healthier path, and you get stuck in all the weeds. What do you do? You get out of the weeds. You simplify. Look, a lot cleaner path here, right? Look, see all the footprints? Not too many footprints over there. Nobody wants to get stuck in the weeds. All the footprints are here. It's a nice, clean path. And that's what you need. You need a nice, clean path. So how do you get a nice, clean path for your weekends? Is you keep it simple. Keep it simple. And here's two things. Minimize to maximize. Minimize. Minimize your weekends. Don't overcomplicate. Don't overcommit. It's okay to say no. If you get stuck, if you're like, oh, I'm going to get around these crowd of people. We're going to be hanging out. Enjoy your life. Enjoy time with your friends. But just make things Simplify, and the way to do that so you don't get confused over the weekend, you don't get stuck in all of the seaweed, is to do this. You make a plan. You literally map it out today. Before the weekend comes, before you kind of let loose, if you will, just literally single page of paper. You can put it on page of paper. (laughs) You can put it in your notes, like on your phone. And like, okay, Friday, this is what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna have breakfast, lunch, and dinner. Then dinner is gonna be out. Well, what do you wanna do to achieve your weight loss goals or to stay on track? You're gonna make a plan on Saturday, same thing. On Sunday, same thing. You map it out. That way, when you go in, even if it's a little bit off course, chances are you're going to keep on that clear path. Nice and easy, clear path. When you start to get confused, when you start to add in so many things, right? You start to add in, this doesn't look, it's kind of stinky too. There's flies around, look at that, it's kind of nasty flies flying around garbage see look you don't want to be like this bottle cap and get stuck look at that thing see that thing stuck in the weeds don't get stuck in the weeds this weekend and listen if you need help if you've been stuck in the weeds not just on your weekends if you've been stuck in the weeds for a very long time reach out to me send me a message and we'll talk about it weekends don't have to be your weekends week ends anymore. Typically, that's what happens. People that are trying to lose weight, get on a healthier path, get stuck on the weekends, and then they come back on Monday. They're like, oh, why did I do it again? I put myself back in that prison over the weekends. I went overboard. I feel terrible about myself. My clothes don't fit. I overate. I overdrank. I was too lazy. I didn't work out. And then guess what? And you're right back to square one on Monday, starting over. And Gosh, wouldn't it be nice to not go through Groundhog Day and to have to start over every single Monday? If you want to get out of that prison, get unshackled, if you will, from the handcuffs, reach out to me and we'll do it together. Take care. God bless.